I want to come back to Sydney. You know that I am a Marine, because once a Marine, always a Marine. You know, I'm the Bible-toting, scripture-quoting, sin-defacing, devil-chasing, chorus-humming, guitar-strumming, gospel-preaching, soul-reaching, overcoming child of God. I mean, that was me. Peter is called the first apostle, chief. We call him Pope. Does anybody here believe you got to do good works to get to heaven? If you do, raise your hand. You better start raising your hands. <laughs> I know, I knew it a little while ago. And if Tim Staples was here, right? The level of disagreement, folks, among Protestant theologians and churches and communities is so incredible. Find out why they're not Catholic. Because see, it's one thing to know apologetics arguments and be able to, you know, be quick on the draw and quote scriptures. But it's another thing when you're full of the Holy Spirit and you've got the power of God in your life. And I preached from the pulpit how ludicrous Catholic theology was. It's the bodily acting out of that spiritual commitment. Without the spiritual commitment, the bodily acting out is a lie. If you compromise the truth, you lose the power to do any good. Some verses of scripture are hard to understand, but that's not one of them. That's as easy as it gets. This is the victory that overcomes the world, even our faith. Now, when you share that with a, a of Protestants, most Protestants don't know that's what we teach. You're going to put that Bible in, in, down and say, boy, we must be justified by faith alone. Because the Bible says we're justified not by faith alone. So what's up with you Catholics saying you got to do good works? I had never heard a response like the one I got from Matt. They will tell you why they're not Catholic. And then you respond to them. If you've reached the age of accountability, when you die, your eternity is sealed. You are either going to heaven or hell. Amen? The image of a man living his Catholic faith is so foreign today to Western civilization, we wouldn't know it if we saw it. Because when you learn to speak Bible, my friends, you will learn your own faith. Because guys and girls, the Bible's our book! Pope Leo the Great said, O oh Christian, if you but knew who you were, you would never fall back into your former sins. The Catholics, you tell me, man, I'm not afraid anymore. Are you kidding me? I can't wait till the Mormon comes to my house. God says, thou shalt not, and you guys shall all over the place. And there shall be one fold and one shepherd. Amen. I, I, I have to say, I was out Bibled by a Catholic. Our faith is reasonable. If we can empower Sydney, Australia and the Catholics of Sydney, Australia to believe and know in the inner fiber of your being that you are right. The Catholic Church is right. Our faith is reasonable. We can go out into this world with confidence and we can change Australia. You people that have been to all of them, you get a bypass purgatory pass. <laughs> all right, you're going straight to heaven. Anyway. <laughs>